Let us therefore fear, lest a promise being left us of entering into his rest, any of you should seem to come short of it. Now, as he starts out here, he's saying entering into his rest. In other words, entering into Christ. And I want you to hold your place here and turn to Matthew chapter 11. A few weeks ago, we had Matthew chapter 11, verses 28 through 30 as our church memory verse. And we're going to go and look at that. And again, salvation is not by works. We must cease from trusting in our own dead works and only trust in the finished work of Jesus Christ. We must enter into His rest. We rest from our works. We cease from our works and we trust in the works that Christ has finished. Again, His works were finished and His sinless sacrifice alone can atone for our sins. It alone can save our soul. And that's the picture of rest that we're going to see here in Hebrews chapter 4. Now, here's Jesus speaking in Matthew chapter 11. Look at verse number 28. Come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden, and I will give you rest. So Jesus making this point here that I think there are a lot of people that are working to find salvation or they're studying to find the answer. They're working really hard to please God and maybe they're not quite reconciled with God. And he says, come unto me, all ye that labor and are heavy laden and I will give you rest. This is a promise from Jesus Christ. And look, if you're working to find salvation, you need to know you can rest in Jesus Christ. Look at verse 29. He says, take my yoke upon you and learn of me, for I am meek and lowly in heart, and ye shall find rest unto your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. Boy, that's almost a contradiction. A burden is something you would think of heavy that's on your shoulders. You're you know, like an ox carrying a burden as they work. And he says, cease from your own works, lay down your works, and put on the Lord Jesus Christ. Trust on the Lord Jesus Christ. And he says, my yoke is easy. How do you get saved? Well, you learn of Christ. You trust of Christ. And salvation is easy. Now look, the Christian life, boy, that is a hard thing.